so hi friend this is amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video so in this video i will talk about josa counseling 2021 that is here i will consider all your question and i will try to provide to the point answer so that you will not have any type of doubt regarding the josa counseling as you all know the round one result is already announced yesterday so i am here to provide you all the question and answer regarding the josa counseling 2021 so that you won't have to face any type of problem till your admission is done and here i will also consider a question that is will the cut off rise in next round or not because the student have so much tension many student don't get the seat so what are what are the chances now so i will try to provide you that also and actually i am making this video a little bit late because there was some personal problem with me so i was not available from last 2 to 3 days so sorry to all the student who are registered with me for the counseling guidance because i was not available but i try to reply as as much as possible so that your all doubt will be clear and if you have any more doubt you can contact me any time to my instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box but if you are registered then only because because i have provided my number and insta only for complete counseling guidance if you have any doubt after watching this video you can comment down your question but not try to use the insta or whatsapp because that is only for complete counseling guidance and one more thing the complete counseling guidance doesn't mean only choice filling because you have to take so many important decision till your admission is done i can help you in all of them and i know many student are doing multiple counseling classes such as Jack Delhi, Jack Chandigarh, OJ, UPTU, Comet, KKCT. So I can help you in all those counseling also. So if you want, you can register with me so that I can guide you for everything. Whether you should go with this college or that college, what type of decision you have to make in the counseling after first round, whether you should take the college or uh, or there will be a risk with a uh, freeze option or float option. So all those things we will have a separate discussion, but only if you register with me. So if you want, you can contact me anytime through Instagram or WhatsApp number available in the description box. So Let's continue this video that is here I will also talk about the documents because many students have the doubt regarding the documents what are the documents required till the final admission is done and I will also talk about the expected cut off what you can expect this year till the last round I will consider this question also and uh, there are some problem going on with the payment many students have told me that they have done the payment but it is not reflected in the website so what you can do after that so all those things I will try to provide you in this video so if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get the complete information regarding the JOSA counseling and other counseling other interest exam also in this channel only so please try to subscribe my channel it's my humble request request and if you want counseling guidance you can contact me anytime through instagram or whatsapp number and one more time i would like to inform you there can't be a general counseling for all the spread if some questions answer is yes for someone then it might be no for you because some uh, some students are asking just tell me yes or no yes or no it is not like that it is about your career so try to think again and try to discuss with an experienced person i am not saying there is with me you can take the help of any experienced person but if you don't have i am here to help you but only after the registration because it takes so much time because I will discuss all the thing I will consider your interest as well after that I can provide you the decision because it's about your career so I can't tell just yes or no because different student have different type of rank different type of personal interest different type of family background so it needs a detailed discussion so if you want you can contact me through Instagram or WhatsApp number once you register I will guide you for all the counseling till your final admission is done so let's start this video so here is the Josa counseling round one question and answer. Here is the first question. Didn't get seat. What next? So here this is very important question and please keep your patience. This is only the first round. Even after mock round also many students got so much right. depressed. So I will suggest uh, it, uh, just take it as a mock mock allotment because the, in the first round as I told you uh, in the mock allotment also they are providing the seat to every student but every student will not take the seat and ultimately you will get the seat in the further round no so need to worry but if you have very low rank if you are thinking i will not get the expected college what, uh, I, what I am expecting so you need to think again and again and you need to consult with the experienced person if you don't have you can contact me so that i can provide you the information uh, where what are the other opportunity for you if you have appeared in comet key examination mst ct examination or you can do uh, multiple counseling based on your je means score as well so what are the option you can discuss with me so that you can join those colleges because your rank is not so good yeah, in the je means to get the good college through JOSA counseling. So this is about the student who didn't get any type of seat. Don't lose your keep your patience. If you not keep your patience, you might get into the wrong college or wrong branch because it is very important time of your career. So keep your patience so that you can get into the right college and right branch. 
so next uh, will cut off rise in further rounds it's 100% sure the cut off will go to higher rank in the next round because you can take the reference of last year as well uh, so next question is what is the expected cut off for this till now the round 1 cut off is not announced yet so once the round 1 cut off will be announced i will try to compare with the previous year uh, after applying all the factor of this year i will try to provide the expected cut off what you can expect in the last round very soon in this channel only so please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get that video very soon so the next question is what are the document required and upload problem so document required you can check side wise i have provided there are few document they are taking now for just to uh, verify the student and the rest of the document will uh, you have to provide at the time of admission in the college uh, whenever you will reach the college they will take the hard copy so prepare all the all the document that is the hard copy with yourself so that you won't have to face any type of problem in the future uh, if you have any type of problem in uploading those uh, those documents just try to see the instruction clearly because the instruction is clearly made the size should be a uh, fixed you can check the size what should be the size of the uh, document and the format of the document try to maintain that and you can upload that it should be clear looking then it will be uh, acceptable for sure and if it is not accepted by uh, the authority that is josa then try to make it again and if you are providing the original certificate then try to make it with the format because they will check through a computer so it is not possible to check all those different type of format certificate with the help of computer so try to provide in the given format you can check the format on the official website there is available that is certificate format whether you are from obc sc st or you need medical certificate there are all the documents required uh, all, all the, the format is available you can check that now next question is payment problem so many students are saying that they have paid the fee but it is not reflected in the website so try to wait some time because there are so many students who are paying the amount at the same time so there is some server issue so no need to think again about this if you have done the payment be relaxed you will get the allotment later very soon and you will get the verification and also very soon so no need to worry if your if your money is deducted from your account no need to worry and one more thing they they will ask you for a ask you for account number and ifc code of a bank in which you will take the refund if applicable suppose after after all the round you will not take the admission and you want refund of your 15000 or 35000 whatever you pay so you will get the amount in that account itself you can pay the amount that is 15 or 35000 from any account uh, whatever you have but you will get the refund in that account itself so, so if I, possible try, try to provide the bank detail of your family member and load right. the photo of the passbook of that account so next question decision making whether you should do float option slide option or freeze option for this detailed video i have already uploaded but i will suggest you take it very seriously because once you do mistake you might lose your seat that you already have got because many student have done the choice filling incorrectly so if you have done the choice filling incorrectly you might get the wrong choice in that you don't want to take admission and uh, you will lose the good a good college that you already have got so, so this type of confusion needs detailed discussion so if you want you can contact me anytime through the instagram or whatsapp number once you register try to listen it carefully without registration i will not guide any student so once you registered then only i will proceed further and guide i will guide you till your final admission is done you can call me any number of time for any type of doubt i will i will always there to provide you all the solution because counseling is about complete mentorship it is not like once i will talk with you and everything will be done time to time you have to take the decision so time to time uh, you oh, you have to discuss with me so every time i will be available so if you want you can contact me so that you can take the decision correctly and decision making not only freeze float or slide it is also like whether i should go with this branch or that branch this college or that college because uh, a huge number of students are doing the multiple counseling uh, along with the josa counseling so it needs a very clear decision making uh, uh, to get the best out of your rank in each the uh, in each counseling and after that uh, also you have to decide whether you should go with this or that so you won't have to regret later after joining a wrong college so next what to do if rank is very low i will include so this question in the first question itself so if you want you can i can watch this video again but i will suggest if your rank is low then try to analyze if your category is supporting then you might get the seat in the last round but if you are looking for csc ec and your rank is very low then you might not get then you have to think about other counseling and what are those if you have appeared in comet k you can do the counseling of that i will suggest do the maximum number of counseling to maximize your chances particularly if your rank is low so if you want you can contact me so that i can guide you for all those chances what you whatever you 
have at your low rank so that you won't have to take a drop because, because drop is not advisable for the sprint but if you are very confident then you can take the drop also but if possible try to take the admission this year because one academic year has so many importance in your career so try to take the college if possible for you so next is what to do if mistake done in choice filling so i have seen many uh, student many student and parents contacted me after the first round that i have done mistake in the choice filling i have put this at wrong place that at wrong place that's why i was uh, i was repeating the statement from last two months that please take the help of any experienced person so that you won't have to regret later once you do mistake now i can't do anything so please don't contact me for that question because no one can do anything in that if you if you want that whether i should go with that choice or not what will, what will happen with that mistake whether i will get good college or not and all those decision making i will try to provide you and i will guide you whether you should take that mistake or not but only after the registration so this is all about this video that is josa counseling round one question and answer hope you find this video very useful and this video will help you throughout the counseling process so try to watch this video again and again and if you have any more doubt please try to comment down not come to install whatsapp because there i will reply to your message only if you want counseling guidance otherwise not possible so thanks for watching this video please try to subscribe this channel thanks